I believe some or all demons have or are given some type of access to our minds. I believe some or all demons can read our minds. You may not believe these things to be true, but I believe these things to be true. You may believe a certain thought is coming from you, but would you know if it is coming from demons? I have no interest in thinking sexually. There are times when I receive sexual thoughts. Where are those thoughts coming from? Myself? I don't think so. God? I don't think so. Demons? I think so. If you are having unwanted thoughts consisting of lust, homosexuality, lying, cheating, unforgiveness, hatred, so on and so on, I believe those thoughts are coming from demons. How can I say this? What if I gave you thoughts? No. <laughs> How can I say this? What if Let's say I gave you thoughts without you knowing it. And let's say you find out I gave you those thoughts. Would you say those thoughts came from you? Or would you say those thoughts came from me? If you found out I gave you thoughts, would you say those thoughts came from you? I don't think so, right? If demons are giving you thoughts and if they are going against God, don't accept them as your own. Don't believe those thoughts are coming from you. I believe Demons can give us thoughts. I believe that. So, if you are having unwanted thoughts about constant grief, reject it. Because if it is unwanted, how is it coming from you? How? Let me say this. If I don't want to eat cake, let's say I wake up with <laughs> cake around my mouth <laughs> and face.
would I say I put the cake on my mind? Maybe that is a bad example. <laughs> what if... <laughs> what if... I don't like cake. And I wake up with cake around my mouth and face and hair. Would I say... I put cake around those areas if I know it wasn't me? I believe if if it wasn't me, I think it would have to be someone else, right? I pray this is making sense to you. Let me stop here. God bless you.